tired, but we're gonna we're gonna change. So then I'm gonna wipe this all off, and then we're gonna go for dinner. Oh my god, this is my karaoke song, Josh. I love this song. It's Kawaii. My winner. Anyway, we're gonna be there in 15 minutes. This is Sophia's Airbnb. Look how roomy it is. Let me check out the tub, the infamous tub. <gasps> Shut the front door. So, Candace, you want to do like a twirl in your dress for the camera? I don't want to. Oh, okay. Do you want to? No. Yeah, then why'd you ask me? We're gonna figure out what we're gonna do for dinner and figure out if we're gonna go out and keep this makeup on. I'm gonna take off my fake yeah, eyelashes. Am I pulling out my own lash? Oh, that hurts so bad. Oh. Holy crap. This shit is stuck. You would be a good godmother. I would not. I hate kids. <laughs> or not. <laughs> I'm literally like, I don't understand. I, I, I just have like a rational fear that kids are always going to turn out crazy. Or they're going to turn out like haunted. What? Because I watch so much horror movies. Oh, but it's Miriam's kid. I mean, I don't know. It's, it's, mm -hmm. I mean, Miriam is not a normal person. <laughs> well... <laughs> We are now removing all our makeup. I mean, we're going to eat soup. I feel like us going in this makeup would be a little too intimidating. <laughs> wow, there's so much. Oh, okay. oh shit. I was like, I'll keep my brows and I literally wiped right across. <laughs> I'm just gonna get rid of my brows too. I <laughs> fuck it, I can't. I'm never watching Mulan. I don't understand the appeal of Mulan. I'm sorry, Mulan. You're Chinese and I'm Chinese, but I just don't see it. Ah, <sighs> I feel like I look better like this. I look better ugly. Okay, so we had a little um, almost mishap at the Airbnb because initially Sophia said it was a-okay for me to stay there for two nights and then suddenly the host was like no nah. yeah i'm talking to um so there's like a family living here and so i talked to the, the wife and she said she told me in person to go to the and i was like oh yeah we'll give you a little bit of and i was like candace so i'm just confirming that my friend will stay over like tonight and tomorrow night and then i got a response saying, no no she won't be <laughs> i like went downstairs and I she caused a scene she I, caused a huge scene no i <laughs> In the end, it worked out, so... Just watch, like, later tonight at, like, 8pm. Be like, no, I'm sorry, she has to leave. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, I okay. could go, but I would, it would be devastating. Like, I have no job, I have no friends. Like, isolation. where am I gonna get it? Where am I gonna get it? But, you know, most people that get it say they get it from weddings. <laughs> Kenneth! <laughs> oh my god, we just came back from wedding. <laughs> You can't say that. Well, you never know. We're so excited to eat. And she's playing Mystic Messenger. Dude, I'm almost done. So okay, we're going to um, this restaurant called... Uh, Hong Kong Flavor. Hong, Hong Kong Flavor. Um, I was really craving congee. And, you know, obviously Candace is really supportive of that. I love congee too. I mean, I yeah. don't think I would have congee. <laughs> But like, we'll take a look. I'm eating Hong Kong food as a Hong Kong person with a Korean friend. <laughs> I know, I haven't done this before. Oh my god, this is crazy. I've always eaten Korean food with Korean friends. Yeah. Now it's the Cons opposite. Like, I definitely went to have like dim sum with Chinese yeah. friends, but not like Hong Kong food with Hong Kong friends. Oh my god, I'm the first one, I'm the first Honger with her. We demolished that. Just kidding. We packed it to go. I'm like 40 pounds.